All right, this is the banjo part for Long Journey Home. This one is easy and complicated at the same time. Um, so I had to write it down to make sure I did it correctly. Basically, the whole thing is pluck, strum, pluck, strum, like all of our songs have been. It's gonna just kinda go up and down the strings from low to high. So the first part is gonna go on that lowest string. Since we're capoed up, that's an E. We have E, strum, pluck, strum. So that was the second one. Try it with me. Go on, pluck, strum, pluck. And on that second strum, put your pointer finger down on the second fret there of that low string and do a strum like that. So one, strum, two, strum, then go up to the next string. Right now that is an A string and go pluck, strum, one more. Then on that, str that second strum, put your pointer finger down on that second fret. So from the beginning, we've had lowest string, pluck, strum, pluck, strum, next string, pluck, strum, pluck, strum, go to the next string, pluck, strum, pluck, then go back down. So that's the second fret of that A string. All right, let's take it back all the way to the beginning, nice and slow. One, two, three, four, five, six, Back to open. Two, three, four. All right. So let's try that from the beginning. We had one more time. Low string, ready, and one, two. Next string up. Next string up. Go back down. That's the whole first part. There's four in total. Uh, next part is going to go back up to that C sharp. That is the second string from the bottom. And it's going to go one, two, then it's going to go to that B, which is the second fret of that A string. And that's the strum. Start it back over with me. So C sharp string, open, pluck, strum, pluck, strum, and that's that C, uh, B on the A string. Then it goes to A string, open, pluck, strum, pluck, then it's going to go to a D chord. So everything we've done so far was an A chord, the D chord, I'm going to move it so you can see the frets. Typically the way we do our D chord we have our pointer finger right here and our middle finger right there. And that's pretty standard, uh, easiest way to play the D. A full D looks like this, with your middle finger on the lowest string, second fret, and uh, ring finger on the highest string, second fret, and pointer finger just staying where it's normally at. To make this easier, we're going to Take our ring finger off, and it leaves us with just this string, and that string being fretted. If it's easy for you to play all three at the same time, that's okay. That just makes it sound even more correct. But this is good enough to get by with. So, refresher, this is how we normally do a D, and for the other songs, I want you to keep doing your D like this. But for this one, I want you to do this fingering for your D. All right, so let's hop back in. We're on that second line, starting on that C sharp. We went pluck, strum, pluck, strum. Then open on the A, pluck, strum, pluck. Then I want you to do that new D chord and you're gonna pluck on the lowest string. Strum, go pluck on the A, and then strum again. Then open on the low. So let's try that again on the C sharp. 
Take it nice and slow. I'm trying to get to where you can see both string and fingerings. All right, so C sharp. One, strong. Two, get your B. Then C pluck. Open. D chord. So I'm going to do both lines we've done so far. Starting at the very beginning. Lowest note, E. Second line. line is almost identical to the first line so walk it up with me this next part you're going to strum and then we're going to the fourth line which is the high string, the high E. And you're gonna go pluck, strum, go down to the C string again. Then do an E chord and pluck the uh, A string. And then go release that and get your C sharp string open again. And then strum A, two, So that whole last line, I'm going to do it kind of more together so it's not as scattered. We had E, C, B, C, B, A, two, three, four. So I'm going to go through slowly the whole song and then we'll try and play it. All right, starting on the low string. Ready and. Try and play through the whole thing now. Remember, the melody for this is um, Lost all my money but a two dollar bill, two dollar bill, boy, two dollar bill. Lost all my money but a two dollar bill. I'm on my long journey home. And when I play through the songs, I have to sing it in my head. All right, if I learned a song by ear, then I kind of have to use all my memory just to remember how it goes. And that's useful. So let's give it a try. Gone through the song, just pluck strum to begin with. Second time through, I'll go into thumb, pluck strum thumb. And then the third time through, I'll take it up to speed. All right, here we go. One, two. Nice and slow. Let me try that again. One, two, ready, and... D chord. 
E chord.